honey buns it's demi welcome back to my youtube channel or if you're just joining us now welcome so for today's video as you can tell by the title i'm going to be doing only eating mcdonald's for 24 hours with a twist so basically the twist in my video on my version of this video is that I've been vegan following a plant-based lifestyle for a month and a half now and I'm not gonna let a YouTube video challenge stop me from doing that I feel quite strongly about it at the moment I'm thoroughly enjoying it therefore I'm gonna be doing this as a vegan McDonald's isn't the most vegan friendly place but with a bit of preparation a bit of planning it's something that can be done so last night I basically planned out what I was going to be eating for breakfast lunch dinner and snacks and my drinks and then I planned it all down and I also written the calories down as well because I'm trying to lose weight I want this to be within a certain amount of calories so it's kind of like doing this challenge but as a healthy vegan can you do it? Is it possible? Okay, so I've woke up. I literally had to run to McDonald's drive through like this. Like literally didn't even change my clothes. Went straight in my pyjamas. Cause the plan was to get up at eight o'clock. So I had alarm set from eight until quarter past 10. Of course, I didn't get up till the quarter past 10 alarm and realized I had 15 minutes to catch McDonald's breakfast. So that was this morning's and ick. I ended up getting a black coffee. I'll show you because I know a lot of people like to say, there you go, we have a black coffee. Now I'm not gonna lie, I'm not the biggest fan of black coffees from machines. I just find them a little bit too strong. For breakfast, we got one hash brown and a plain bagel. Now you do actually get Flora and Philadelphia light with the bagel but I can't eat these because I'm vegan so no condiments for me it is toasted as well which is good so yeah I'm just gonna have my breakfast as I would you know Okay, the bagel was bearable. It was a little bit dry, but I do have my coffee to wash it down. I mean, to be fair, I'm not like, I don't mind dry things anyway. So I would eat that again. And now I've got my gorgeous hash brown. In all honesty, if it was like a cheat day, I would probably get two or three of these, but obviously it's not. And I'm trying to stay relatively healthy. So one it is. Mm. You, my friend, are delicious. Brown complete, I'm just going to joyfully sip through my black coffee. So that is breakfast complete. Overall, I'm going to rate it 6 out of 10. Obviously, I would have liked condiments on the bagel. Um, you know, a bit of jam wouldn't have gone amiss. A bit of syrup wouldn't have gone amiss. But it is what it is. I wanted to keep this purely McDonald's based and purely vegan. And obviously, under a certain amount of calories. For breakfast, I've consumed 358 calories. Now, that's breakfast complete. So, today, I'm actually going to buy a new camera. So, the second half of this video might actually be filmed on my new camera or I might keep it for the next video. I'm not 100% sure yet. Okay, so, before I get on with my day, I do actually need to do my skin routine and this is something that I wanted to talk to you about. As you all know, I've spoke about this product quite a long time on my channel now but I absolutely love it and the product that I'm talking about is the Foreo Luna Mini 2. Now this is the product that I'm going to be using. Um, I use it at least once a day but sometimes twice a day. So basically it's a little device with silicone bristles on it at either side. So the ones on the back are more firm and the ones on the front are more soft and you do actually have um, different settings so you turn it on. And it, and it pulsates and you basically have settings to turn the pulsations up or down 
to suit your desire. I've actually been using this for like two months now and honestly this difference in my skin's amazing because when I wash my face just with my fingers, it doesn't really get into the nitty gritty bits. However, when I use the Luna Mini, it really gets into my skin and like digs out all the dirty pores and I've really noticed a difference. And another thing which is amazing about this product or what I find amazing is I've charged this once since I got it and I use it daily. Like a full charge lasts age and say facial wash by Soap and Glory on it. And I just wet my Luna Mini under the tap and off we'll go. I really like to dig it in my chin because that's where my area is prone for spots and blackheads so I like to give it a good dig in. So I usually do that for about three minutes and then I'm just going to take a fluffy flannel and I'm going to run it under the hot water and I'm just going to wash away the soap routine and as you can see my skin has been really good recently and yeah so I do actually use a spray over my face I'm just going to go back to my bedroom and show you the spray that I've been using okay the spray that I've been using is this this is the nature republic soothing and moist aloe vera 92% soothing gel mist now I actually found this online and honestly I love it so so much so I literally just get it it on my face like so skin routine oh it is actually 10 to 2 now i'm filming on my phone so i'm sorry about the quality but i have just went and got a new camera so that should be up and running very very soon but it's lunchtime and i'm starving so for lunch we got a happy meal now the happy meal they've actually not long ago released a vegan happy meal which i'm very excited about so this is the veggie wrap and i added onion i added tomato and i added some cucumber so this is my little wrap a small fries got a tropicana orange juice and i also got two bags of cucumber sticks i'm gonna eat one now and keep one for a snack later on to be honest since i had breakfast this morning so i had my breakfast about half 10 since i had breakfast this morning i've literally been fine i've not been like that hungry so that's why i'm having lunch so late at two o'clock i wouldn't usually have it this late okay let us try this wrap mm. i hope you can see it's got like a little ketchup onion it looks good Holy moly, mother of God. Okay, moving on to my cucumber sticks. This full bag of cucumber only has 12 calories. Like cucumber is got so low calories. Oh, looks a bit off. Well, it's definitely not the freshest cucumber I've ever had McDonald's. But I can live with it. It's all right. So I've had my lunch. I'm going to go now, get my nails done, get my eyebrows done, head back home. I have some admin to do. And I'll check back in with you when I get my tea. <laughs> Okay guys, so I've actually been and had my eyebrows waxed and I got my nails done. I got them like short red because the long nails were catching on things and I was in agony. So I've gone for like a really short red, but I really like them. So I'm quite hungry. It's like four o'clock, I think. So I'm going to snack on my other bag of cucumber sticks and then we'll see how I feel. I've got a spinning class at half five and then after spinning, I'll be getting my tea. Um, but yeah, I'm going to have my cucumbers and see how I feel. 
Hi guys, so I'm in McDonald's drive through again and I'm going to be getting my tea. Dun dun dun! I've just got out of spinning class and I'm absolutely, actually I'm not starving. I always feel after exercise I'm not like starving but I am hungry so I'm going to get it. I'm very excited to be fair. I is ready to see what I got for my tea. So for my tea I got a Diet Coke just for something to like spice up the taste buds. I'm a bit sick of water and then I got a melon bag for after. Veggie Deluxe, but I got um, no meal and add ketchup instead because that makes the burger then vegan. I didn't get any chips because I had chips for lunch and I usually have like my carbs on my main bulky thing at lunch. So anyway, I know there's carb on the bun, but you get my gist. And then I also got that with side salad instead of chips. It just looks like this. But it's like tiny, that salad's really small So I ordered two side salads just to make it a bit more substantial salad into one box just so I like a big box it's very dry looking no not gonna lie I wish I'd picked up a sauce you can't get sauces there's quite a few vegan sauces from McDonald's sweet chili ketchup I think the barbecue yep the barbecue is vegan as well oops I've just dropped a bit of onion I love tomato like I think it was one of the best things put on this earth a tomato Oh, I'm obsessed. She's got like a garden taste to it. Like, it literally tastes like a garden. Like, the thing is, is I get when people say like salad's rabbit food when it tastes like this. But when you have a good salad, it's not rabbit food. Like, it tastes delicious. Like, when you have a good salad. But this just isn't a good one. Like this literally tastes like grass like this is rabbit food but the onions the tomato and the cucumber is delicious i remember once when i was like doing healthy years ago I used to be able to get like a really nice char grilled chicken salad obviously i couldn't get that as vegan but i wonder if you got that but exchanged the chicken for the pieces they put in the burger like the bean things what that would be like I don't know. I get very excited about Diet Coke because I never allow myself to have pop. Like, I always, through the week, especially Monday to Friday, just have water, maybe an orange juice in the morning, and then coffee. I don't allow myself to have pop, but it's a one off. I could have got the bottle of water, but I just thought, no, I need some energy, okay? Okay, I've had enough of the salad. I've had quite a bit of it though. There's just a few rings of onions and a few lettuce leaves that I just can't hack. Um, but yeah, it was okay, quite satisfied. I've got it all on my pants. It's such a messy salad. Well, I mean, I didn't use my knife and fork like, but you know, I've got like proper onion taste and breath. Like good job I'm going home straight from here because can't be bumping into anyone with this breath. Okay, so I've had my side salad. Dun, dun, dun. I'm feeling quite full to be honest, like I'm feeling quite satisfied. But I'm gonna have my melon now as well because it is 22 8 and I don't usually eat after 8, so. So I'm just gonna finish my Coke and then that'll be it for today. This is my. I've still got it in my teeth. So once I've finished my Coke, that is going to be it for today. This is my 24 hours only eating McDonald's as a healthy vegan. So in total, I had 1,336 calories, I believe. Yes, this is my day as a McDonald's eating vegan 
kind of healthy I mean it wasn't too bad like and I feel quite satisfied to be honest so yeah I really hope that you enjoyed this video if you would like us to jump on more food trends with a twist let me know in the comments below I definitely can if you've got any other video suggestions don't forget to leave them in the comments um but yeah without further ado, I will let you go and I'll see you very shortly for another video bye